What is up guys? Don't forget to subscribe, check out my channel playlist for individual tutorials on launcher sculpting, animation, music, and more. And do not forget to subscribe. Follow me on Dreams. I am Young Text, YouTube on Dreams, and I have lots of creations and props for you guys to use for your creations. So publishing element failure, publish dream failure, or you just can't publish what you created. The reason why that happens, in my opinion, now Media Molecule has stated that they are still working for this fix, trying to fix it all together. Um, they said that it could be an internet issue on you on our side. So, um, if that doesn't fix it, what I did was I saved this to my hard drive first. So I saved my dream after I had everything compiled. I didn't have to delete anything. And then I put it into the whole dream, um, and then I saved it to my hard drive by going here, or not here, by go, yeah, I went there, yeah. And then I saved version, and I saved it to my hard drive, then I tried to release it. And I think the reason why this is happening is because Dreams is trying to find elements that it, for some reason, can't find. Whether that be because somebody took it off of their of their profile or because it just can't find it. I think the reason is because um, what I did was I took somebody else's thing, and then I put it into a blank uh, a blank um, start fresh creation, and then I saved it, but I didn't save it online as public. I think that could be it. The reason I didn't save it online as public is because it's somebody else's creation and I don't want to copycat their creation because people apparently got mad at that in Little Big Planet and because I'm just not that kind of a person. So I wouldn't have done that anyway. Um, here's how you can check to see if you if somebody else made their dream unusable if that makes sense what you can do is go to go to the circley things don't go to the thing where you have all your levels compiled the dream go to the thing where the main levels are then go here and if if you like um remixed your uh, first level and then made your level two a remix of level one because it cut back on you having to uh, do logic, if that makes sense. And then try going to level one first. Then what you wanna go to is genealogy. And then what you wanna do is click on the thing. See, this is somebody else's creation, but I had it saved on my thing. So I had to re-upload it. That's why it says not public, because I know they'll probably get a notification and I don't want them to think I'm trying to take their work, if that makes sense. So what you want to do from here is click on their thing. Then you'll want to go to version release and see if this is right here. That's one way you can do it. You can see if that's right there. Um to where it's still a remixable thing. Now, if you got it and you got it while it was remixable, it should, you should still be able to upload it because um, you got it while it was remixable. And I think that's the incentive of dreams, if I'm not mistaken. So you should still be able to upload that. Again, I saved it to my hard drive, and I think that made it to where Dreams could, like, find everything. Now, I haven't double-checked to see if that messed up anything, which it shouldn't have. What I also did was, whenever I released it online, it'll say what you have to upload as public. Like, it'll give the list. So what I also did with some of the things was I went to those individual things and then uploaded them as... Uh, as a private and make sure whenever you're doing this stuff if it's the individual circles and um, hexagons make sure if you upload it upload it as private that way nobody gets a notification if that makes sense and some of this stuff could change in the future so fact check what I say to make sure it is accurate um and that's essentially what I did what I did was just um, went through the list 
And then sometimes I went into the dream after looking at the genealogy. It didn't really help that I deleted stuff from the genealogy because everything was public, right? So I knew that wasn't the issue. What had to be the issue was the dream itself was having trouble finding the true assets location. I think that's what it is. I'm not sure, but I think that's what it is. So what you can do is either track that down, save it to your hard drive like I didn't hope that helps, save uh, the dreams individually as private, um, go to the genealogy and make sure that it is still remixable. And if it's not, you can try altering it a little bit, if that makes sense, and seeing what that does. Um, and that's essentially all you can do outside of asking Media Molecule, what's up? <laughs> and then I noticed like whenever I deleted creations, some creations, like it would take things out of my uh, collections here and then I had to re-put them back in my collection. I didn't delete the thing that I put online but it did take uh, some of these things out of here and then I had to re-put them back in here. So that could kind of help you understand what Dreams is doing with the location of the file, maybe. Just some more information and stuff that might be able to help you figure out what's going on with your, um, with your creation. So, and that's one thing with collections, like with collections that ha happened too. Then I, then I had to like go down here. I think the main thing would be try not to panic because most likely it's a fixable issue. Like, I don't think that it's that like, I feel like everything that could be going on here with everybody's issue with this is most likely fixable. It's just, there's no, like, since there's so many ways to fix it, you have to like figure that out yourself. And that's what kind of makes it, um, make, make, makes anxiety kick in on that part. Cause you spent all this time working on your creation and then you're hit with this roadblock that you don't know what the heck is going on. But if you didn't know what was going on, and I hope this video helps, then, uh, you'd probably be a little less anxious because I'm sure that there's um, a fix to most likely every issue in every circumstance. You, um, especially um, if you, if it's just somebody like, you know, made it to where their thing was, you know, private. And again, I don't see how that would be an issue because Dreams allows you to use things even if they're private. But just in case, and Media Molecule said if you're using a a prize that you got from a prize bubble, then uh, you can't use their prize bubbles in your game. And I'm pretty sure, I'm not sure if it works for other people that way, like if somebody else made their own prize bubble. But I know you can't use Media Molecules, and the, the reason for that is most likely because they are going to have DLC in the future, if that makes sense. So it really only happens when I'm uploading big stuff. Then the maze has to, then, then you kind of have to connect the dots with the maze and figure out what the game is saying. And I wish the game would just say, we can't find this, uh, or, or at least give the reason as to why there's a publishing element failure. Another thing you can do is click on the dream and try to release it and if it says you cannot release this because somebody else's thing is private then you can go to the genealogy from there and um fix that now i don't recommend doing that because i didn't have to do that and some of the things that i had were pri uh, were private but I guess because it was all compiled in a dream, dreams recognized that I got it before it became private. So do that as a last, as a very last, last, last um, 
last card because you most likely do not have to do that. And that means you would have to, in some cases, rework the whole game just to get that one element in there. Because uh, every dream is looking for, uh, every dream isn't working off of that one object. Unless, of course, unless, of course, uh, you had it saved as something like this. And then you can go in here and change it. And then I'm guessing what you could do is edit and then go up here and press update mode. And you could try doing that. You could try doing that. Or you could just try doing that. Sometimes whenever I update it, though, um, it'll, like, take it back to a version that, to last week's version that I did. And whenever that happens, uh, I have to bring it back to the, um, to the most up-to-date version. And that's a really easy fix. What you have to do... is go to versions and releases and then it should have a list of versions if you saved it periodically. So then you can backtrack back to that version and they'll tell you the date right here. So you could do that. You could do that to where you don't have to fix it in every um in every scene if you've put like you know the turret in here and then the turret the, the scenes you're looking from the for the turn in here. And then uh, level one, level two, and level three are all looking for that one scene's turret. You could try that. If you understand what I'm saying here. You could try that. I'm not sure if that would work. I haven't tried it, but that's just one last thing for you guys. One last thing, um, and it'll probably change the way you guys uh, make your games because that really does help with, um, with, with, with that issue, if that is the issue. So I hope you enjoyed this video. Don't forget to subscribe. Follow me on Dreams. I'm Young Text YouTube. And fact check everything I say because I don't want anything that you guys um, created to get deleted. So make sure you test out everything I say by making it remixable first, making a remixable version of it, and then uh, testing it on that remixable version first before you test it on your main version to where you can't get back the stuff unless you, uh, of course, go to your version and releases and then backtrack throughout the dates. That's just uh, just in case. Um, but always fact check what people say about this stuff on YouTube because I realize it's, you know, some people are like on months worth of work and uh, even if it sounds credible, you're just like, whoa, dude, um, delete button. <laughs> so don't forget to follow me on Dreams and uh, subscribe to my Young Tech's YouTube channel. I'm Young Tech's YouTube on Dreams and that's all the fixes that I can think of. Um, I hope this helps. Peace out, peace out, peace out.